Good evening, everyone, and welcome to our midweek worship. Keep us safe, O Lord, in the darkness of this night for the eternal kingdom where there is flaming radiance forever. And we'll just take a moment of quiet to reflect upon the day past as we come into God's presence this evening. Jesus, forgive my sins. Forgive the sins that I can remember and also the sins I have forgotten. Forgive the wrong actions I have committed and the right actions I have omitted. Forgive the times I have been weak in the face of temptation and those when I have been stubborn in the face of correction. Forgive the times I have been proud of my own achievements and those when I have failed to boast of your works. Forgive the harsh judgments I have made of others and the leniency I have shown to myself. Forgive the lies I have told to others and the truths I have avoided. Forgive me the pain I have caused others and the indulgence I have shown to myself. Jesus, have pity on me and make me whole. Amen. O Lord, open our lips and our mouths shall proclaim your praise. From Psalm 90. Lord, you have been our refuge from one generation to another. Before the mountains were brought forth, or the land and the earth were born, from age to age you are God. You turn us back to the dust and say, Go back, O child of earth. For a thousand years in your sight are like yesterday when it is past, and like a watch in the night. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Today's meditation is by Frederick Buchner. Listen to your life. See it for the fathomless mystery that it is. In the boredom and pain of it, no less than in the excitement and gladness. Touch, taste, smell your way to the holy and hidden heart of it. Because in the last analysis, all moments are key moments and life itself is grace. The Canticle. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my saviour. For he has looked with favour on his lowly servant. From this day, all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel for he has remembered his promise of mercy. The promise he made to our forebears, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be forever. Amen. So we come to a time of prayer. 
And we just take a moment of quiet to lift all of those people and situations that lie in our hearts to God. We think particularly of all those things that have been in the news today and recently. And we lift those up. O oh Christ, kindle in our hearts within a flame of love to our neighbour, to our foes, to our friends, to our kindred all. O oh Christ of the poor and the yearning, from the humblest thing that lives to the name that is highest of all, kindle in our hearts within a flame of love. Amen. And let us pray with confidence as our Saviour taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory for ever and ever. Amen. Loving God, may this moment be to us a time of blessing, a time to pause, to thank you for all the good things you give us, to delight in your goodness around us. Open our hearts and minds to your presence, that we may be a blessing to all whom we meet today and in the days ahead. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. May God hold you in his love and fill you with his peace today and every day. Amen. Thank you so much for joining me this evening. Take care and stay safe. God bless.